and what is up all of my beautiful wanderers of the world welcome and or welcome back to my channel in case you guys do not know my name is Walter I'm a flight attendant and you guys are joining me not on another layover but at my humble abode because I had to sit down and tell you something exciting all right don't judge me all right guys so this last week as you could probably actually already know from the title I met probably one of the most famous rappers of definitely 2017 and 2018. Um, just completely um, randomly, just completely out of the blue. So basically, if you did not already know by the title, I met the famous rapper Cardi B. That is right, I'm not Cardi B, I am like still freaking out a little bit about it. So basically, let me start you from the beginning. Oh, but before we get into the story, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to comment because I'm going to like the video. All right, guys, so without further ado, because I'm so bursting to tell you guys the story, let's start from the beginning. So this was on, what was my A-Day? It was A-Day 3. I was on A-Day 3 last week. I was sitting um, standby at John F. Kennedy Airport, and I get a call from crew scheduling, and they're like, oh, we don't need you to fly out of JFK. We actually need to bus you over to LaGuardia, um, where you're going to work a flight from LaGuardia to Atlanta. So I was like, okay, whatever. So I get on the bus, and I go from LaGuardia, I mean, I'm sorry, JFK Airport to LaGuardia Airport, um, sign in and everything, get on the plane, do my safety checks, we start boarding. So I am working A, and if you guys don't know what that is, um, A is just the lead flight attendant. I'm working primarily with first class. Um, so yeah, but I'm also standing at the one left door where everyone enters the airplane. I'm greeting, and I'm my um, beverage service, my pre-departure beverage service for first class. I also have an assist up there, which is basically a person to take over if I need to go out into the aisle and um, get all the first class drink orders. They can stand at the boarding door and greet everyone as they come on. So. Um, we're boarding, we're boarding. I'm getting everything set up in the galley because I was a little bit late because they had to bust me over. Um, so I was a little bit late, so I'm not really paying attention to who's coming on. Um, like I said, I had my assist there. She was greeting everybody, so that was fine. So I'm getting everything set up. I'm getting everything together. Um, and I go out and I start doing my, um, you know, um, pre-departure beverage service. So I'm going out, I'm taking all their drink orders, going, 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 um, and I get to row five, and I look up, and I tell you guys, I'm like, can I, can I get you anything? Because I'm like, in my mind, I'm like, you look so familiar, but let me say she had no makeup on, she had just had her hair in braids, she was like so low-key, so casual, so I didn't really think like, oh, this could be like a famous person, I was like, you just look familiar to me, so I'm like, oh, do you want anything, and I kid you not, guys, as soon as she opened her mouth, I was like, oh my god, she goes, no thank you, like in that Cardi B voice way, and I'm like, wait a minute, no. So I like say, okay, ma'am, I'm trying to keep my composure here and I go on to the other um, 5B, 5C, and 5D because she was working. I mean, she was sitting in 5A. So I go on through um, and get the rest of their drink orders and then I just turn back after I'm done with 5D and I'm just like, this is got to be Cardi B. And then I kid you not, like at that very moment, another per passenger boarding the airplane goes, Cardi, I love you so much, can I have a picture? And she goes, no, I'm sorry, no, no pictures right now. I'm like, oh my God, that really is Cardi B. Like, oh my God. <laughs> so I run literally back um, up to the front of the aircraft and I'm going like to my, like, like, oh my God, Cardi B is sitting in 5A. Oh my God, Cardi B, Cardi B is sitting in 5A. And she's like, what are you talking about? And then she like peeks around the corner and she's like, oh my God, Cardi B. So we're literally sitting, standing in the galley going like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Because we were just like so blown away. When I tell you guys I don't meet many famous people, I do not meet many famous people at all. I think I've met like two or three. And I'm based in New York, so you know, a lot of celebrities come in and out. But like I don't ever get to work with them. So or to get to see them on any of the flights that I work. So basically, yeah, so I was just like so taken aback. And I mean, it's not just any old celebrity, it's Cardi B, like I love her. I've listened to all, I have her album on my phone. I've listened to all of her songs. I love, I like it like that. I love so many of her records. Like it's just like, just crazy. So 
Flash forward to um, we take off, we're up in the air. Um, I had a, a meal to serve, so I was uh, going through and manifesting. Like I said, she's so low key. She didn't want anything to eat. She didn't want anything to drink. Like she was good. So, you know, I'm in the aisle taking care of everybody else. And um, at one point she gets up and goes to the bathroom. So I'm like, oh my God, oh my God, this is my opportunity to talk to her after she gets out of the bathroom. So she goes in, she uses the bathroom. Uh, comes out and I'm like, oh my god, Cardi, I love you so much. And I kid you not, guys, as she's going on the way back to her seat, she goes, ah, like, thank you. I'm like, oh my god. Like, I could not believe it. It was the, like, coolest, coolest experience ever. Like, oh my god, like, actually getting to talk to her, like, exchanging words. I mean, we didn't have a full-blown conversation, but still, like, I actually got to say words to this woman. Ridiculous. So, you know, she goes back, she sits down, she doesn't, you know, want anything else for the rest of the flight. And then I'm like, okay, you know what? I've talked to her, there's nothing else for it. I have to ask for a picture. And I'm like freaking out inside because she had already denied somebody else a picture. I didn't want her to deny me because I'm gonna be so heartbroken if I can't get a picture with her. So I'm, there's a jump seater on my flight and if you guys don't know who that is, it's just it's a flight attendant who's just going from one base to another, they're not actually working. So she's sitting up there with me. She's like, oh my God, just do it. I'm gonna have your phone ready. I'm gonna have it already on like the picture mode. So just go ahead and ask her. If she says yes, I'm gonna snap it and it'll be quick and she can go. So I kid you not guys, when we land, she takes a little bit of time to like get up because most of first class had already left. And then she gets up and she leaves and I'm and she gets up to, to leave. And I'm like, oh my God, Cardi, can I please have just a picture with you? Like really, really quickly, just a picture. And she's like, Okay, I'm like, oh my god, and so literally, literally just like, kind of like, she stands beside me, like I said, the jump seater, she was so sweet, she had the picture ready, she had the phone ready to go, she snapped the picture, and guys, you've already, it's already the thumbnail for this video, I already know, but I'm gonna show you guys, just quickly, this was the photo with me and Cardi B, like, can you see it, can you see it, uh, glare. <laughs> But anyways, that's her and that's me, <laughs> if you can't see it. <laughs> so yeah, so basically she snapped that quick picture with me. This was in Atlanta and then she like leaves. I didn't even like get a chance. I looked at the picture just to make sure that it wasn't like blurry or anything. And by the time I looked back, she had already like disappeared. So I was like, oh my God. And so yeah. So as soon as I got a chance, I uh, text, uh, text, text, Jose, if he's my best flight attendant friend, so I texted him because he loves her. He's a stan, like he stands Cardi B. He's Dominican, she's Dominican, she's like the Dominican champ, like everything. So I texted him and he, you know, quickly wastes no time in telling me how much he hates me. <laughs> like literally can't stand me, whatever, I don't care. Be jealous, Jose, because I met her and you didn't. So yeah, so the next day after this, I posted on Instagram and I cannot tell you guys I didn't expect I, th I thought it would do well like as a picture but I did not think it was going to blow up this much guys I did not think that at all literally at this point um, like four four days later and I just literally just got another like on a picture um, literally has 800, 986 likes this is clearly my most liked picture ever I gained like 300 over 300 ish new followers on my Instagram. I'm like mind blown. I have been reposted. This picture has been reposted, I kid you not, eight times by different like fan accounts of hers, like different uh, flight attendant accounts. Like, just it has blown up so much. I had like 60 something comments on the on the on the pictures and that's not to say how many likes the reposts have gotten on their channel account, I mean channels, their accounts. It's just been crazy. So, I just had to sit down and tell you guys like literally the biggest to me the biggest celebrity. Like I love this woman like love her and I yeah I got a chance to meet her I think the only person above that is Beyonce to be honest you know that's the only other person I and mean, you'll never see her she's like a ghost like she flies private so you'll never see her but yeah just 
Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed my little story time of how I met probably the biggest female rapper or one of the biggest female rappers in the game right now. I hope you guys enjoyed the video um, and I will see you on the next one. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe and don't, you know, watch another video. I got plenty of travel vlogs over here. So if you're mad that this is a travel vlog, I got plenty. You haven't seen all of them, I'm sure. So go ahead and watch one and don't forget to subscribe. I love you guys and I will see you on the next one. Boom! I met Cardi B. <laughs>